Molt bé, bona nit a tothom. En nom del president Josep Oliu, que finalment no ha pogut estar avui amb nosaltres, us vull donar la benvinguda de nou al Banc Sabadell. Una benvinguda especial a l'Enriqueta Aragonès en la seva primera Barcelona Lecture, en què ens acompanya en la nova condició de directora de la Barcelona Graduate School of Economics Research Network. And a very warm welcome to our speaker today, Professor Sterdufo. Um, I want to recall with satisfaction more than three years of collaboration of the Barcelona Graduate School of Economic Research Network and Bank Sabadell, uh, this joint venture that builds a bridge between the academic and the business world, brings us together here today for the 15th edition of the Barcelona Lecture. Within this framework, we enjoy frontier research through lectures by the most outstanding researchers in economics. In an economic moment when the developed economies are concerned about how to overcome a recession that has proved to be longer and deeper than what we had initially expected, it is highly appropriate to be reminded that many countries in the world have more basic concerns. People die because of lack of humanization or of hunger because fertilizers are not used appropriately. Huge amounts of money are dedicated to helping developing countries, but many times little is known about the effectiveness of the programs in what the money is spent. Our speaker today, Professor Esther Duflo, has much to say about how to fight poverty effectively. She has focused her research in randomized evaluation of development projects, and she has emphasized that program design and the incentives built in a project are crucial for the outcome of any developing program. Her approach differs from standard development economies and sheds light for the design and the focus of how developed countries could help developing countries in improving their economic conditions. Her CV is impressive, more so if one takes into account her relatively short career, as she obtained her PhD from MIT not even 10 years ago. She is director of the Abdul Latif Jamel Poverty Action Lab at MIT, but she has also kept some uh, links with her French roots, being the inaugural holder of the chair Knowledge Against Poverty at the Collège de France. I will not go into more detail in Professor Duflo's outstanding CV, as Enriqueta Aragonés will present a profile to our speaker following what is our tradition in the Barcelona Economic Lectures. So I just want to welcome Professor Duflo again, and thanks very much for being here. On behalf of the, Bar the Barcelona Graduate School of Economics Research Network, first of all, I would like to thank Bank de Sabadell for its continued support of this series of lectures. And then I would like to welcome Esther Duflo to our research community, which includes, as you probably know by now, research faculty from Universitat Pompeu Fabra, from Universitat Autónoma de Barcelona, and from the Institute d'Analisi Econòmica. Esther was born in France, she studied both history and economics at the Col Normal Superior in Paris and decided to specialize in economics with a master at Delta and a PhD at MIT. Since she finished her PhD, she has been a professor of economics at MIT, where she currently holds the position or of Abdul Latif Jamil, professor of poverty alleviation and development economics. She has a long list of articles published in the best journals, and she has also published a large number of books. She has been associate editor of the Review of Economics and Statistics, of the Journal of the European Economic Association, and of the Journal of Economic Perspective. She has been co-editor of the Review of, Econ of, e of, e of Economics and Statistics, and of the Journal of Development Economics. And she is currently a member of the Board of Editors of the Annual Review of Economics, and a founding editor of the American Economic Journal Applied Economics. Among the many honors and awards that she has received, in 2005, she was awarded the Best Young French Economist Prize by Le Monde Cercle des Economistes. 
and also in 2005, the bronze medal from the Center, Centre National de la Recherche Scientifique. And in 2003, she was awarded the American Economic Association's Elaine Bennett Prize for Research. As Teresa said, a few days ago, she has been awarded the Chair in Knowledge Against Poverty at the College de France. And also recently, The Economist listed her as one of the best young economists of the world. And uh, so The Economist listed a number of young, uh, eight young economists of the world, but she was the one that got the most votes. She is uh, the director of the development program at the CPR. She is a board member of the Bureau of Res for Research and Economic Analysis of Development. And she is also the director of the Abdul Latif Jamil Poverty, Poverty Action Lab. Uh, she specializes in development economics and the design and rigorous evaluation of effective anti-poverty policies. And among other things, she has studied household behavior and, ed and educational choice, returns to education and social, uh, social services delivery in developing countries. In some of her projects, she refers to the issue of gender. She has shown also that affirmative action in favor of women has a positive impact. So it is a great pleasure for me to introduce her as the first female speaker of this Barcelona Economics Lecture Series. Thank you very much. Uh, I wonder whether I finish something. Can people hear if I stand? Can I hear? Okay, I think it's fine. Uh, sorry. 